Hey knuckleheads, welcome back to Sis in the City. So if y'all remember from last week, Shorty and ADHD Sis here said they were going to start having the finalists come in and guest star on the show and pretty much see what the chemistry between the three of them is like. So the first finalist was Jayla Johnson, aka 32 Flavors, and I know what everybody is wondering, did Sis behave himself? Let's see what happens, shall we? But let's talk about the DLB and in the church. Let's talk about how I was sleeping with pastors and bishops. Hey, 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 hey. Yes, Lord, hey. Do y'all hear what I'm saying? They talking about this a blouse. This is a man's shirt. <laughs> this, this, this do not look like no blouse, do it? No. <laughs> Bitch, you are I'm not famous, you are not known. Coming, I know damn hard to talk about what I'm wondering. Bitch, please. I'm not going to argue with you. Please. 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 Stop bringing these niggas to my house. Stop bringing these niggas to my house. Hold me, please. Hold me, please. Hold me, please. Hold me, please. Love Andrew Carwell, and we got our girl 32 Flavors in the studio. How you feeling this morning, 32? I'm feeling too good, y'all. Okay, now it's time to get into some people business. Ain't our business, but it's day business. I like what's it going on. Okay, I'm sure you do, Drew. Okay, what's happening in people's life and world and entertainment and all that? All right, listen. So, your favorite trapper's favorite trapper has filed for divorce, y'all. So, they tied the knot in April 2021. They had their baby 2022. And here we are talking about a divorce. Mm. And it looks like it's trouble in paradise everywhere because Iman and Tiana are separated too, y'all. Damn. It's going crazy. Did, I don't know what's going on. Did you see when you saw the Jeezy and Jenny Ma thing? Were you surprised or were you like, mm. I was not surprised. Really? And because I feel like they come from two different backgrounds. She got to learn the lyrics to Thug Motivation. I ain't never heard of a Magic City on a Monday. Oh. Like, what? Well, I knew that was, I actually knew that that um, that um wedding was not going to last long. Y'all knew it was coming because Sis knows everything, of course. Can I ask though, when does Sis become so wise, so all-knowing? Like, I must have missed that memo. Number one, they got married during COVID mm -hmm. uh, when okay. everybody was down. Okay. And then number two, uh, you know, she followed me and then unfollowed me. That's why they so, were So um, I'm like, girl. <laughs> I'm going to need you to contain that reaction because it didn't do me any good. Bye. <laughs> uh, yeah, you show that's right. right right there. But you know what's funny is that, like they say, Jenny Ma, um, out of her, I guess, first marriage, mm -hmm. they, they broke up because she didn't want kids. And then she get with Jeezy, have a kid, and now they divorced. Um, because she has a temper problem. Is that what she it is? Did. Yes. She came out and said that she was struggling with her temper and she didn't realize it till she got with Jeezy. Correct. So Jeezy oh, probably wow. shut it all down like, hold but this, on. But this my thing right here, Jeezy. You was dealing with black women before her. A yeah. temper ain't nothing new. Maybe hers is worse than ours. Mm -hmm. I don't know. She probably get to talk another language. Get Listen, hey, you better you, you better like, speak. Yeah, you better speak English right here. Yeah. <laughs> you know, her and her mom they, they do too hey, much. Hey, you better say you better say everything I understand hey, in my house. Straight up, <laughs> chill. All right, <laughs> what's the next teacher? All right, what else going on, thirty two? Listen, Tyler Perry sat down with Krista Renee, y'all, and he uh -oh. got the internet in a frenzy. Uh -oh. So the topic was black women and dating, and basically he was saying that it is okay to date a man who is not making as much as you as long as he treating you right, loving you right, treating you good. Man, listen, I know somebody just uh, dropped their baby mama off at work like, yeah, Tyler! Speak. I don't agree with that, but let's go ahead and see what you have to um, say, 32 Flavors. Speak. Listen, it's highs and lows in life, okay? I might be up one season, you might be down one season, and vice versa. I feel like there's nothing wrong with taking care of the, the home if you have to if your mm. partner cannot now you gonna have to do a little bit more than the light bill yeah. you gonna have to go run some Amazon packages sell some lemonade something something but I do feel like it is okay to help your partner out in a time of need but they gonna have to show some effort you not finna be just kissing me on the way out the door every morning not getting up doing yeah, nothing it don't went from 50-50 to like you know just let him do what he can yeah, baby no. you no. You over here paying the Wi-Fi bill no <laughs> mm -mm, you better go take out <laughs> see my, at my you better know. Uber Eats DoorDash <laughs> my standpoint is that's why you gotta always make sure you buying all these designers and stuff uh -huh. you're doing everything make sure while you edit your credit is decent cause you never know when you have to you take out a line of credit 
Or oh, a line of credit, child. Mm-hmm. Hey, ladies, we want to know from you. Look, from you listening right now, is, is are you feeling what Tyler Perry is saying? Are you going to support that man? If he can only pay that light bill, if he can only put a little bit of gas in the car, you know what I'm saying? Here, if he can only pay the Netflix account. He can only do for Not seven on part three. Okay, that's it. <laughs> Out there looking like he forgot. Uh, let me get seven on. Uh. Uh, nah, you know. 314-659-1041. 314-659-1041. Do you support Tyler Perry and his support of... No. No? No. <laughs> I don't support it. Okay. I think she did well there. She seems knowledgeable about the current events, good personality, good chemistry with Shorty, and sis. Plus, she's a fellow brown skin girl, so bonus points for that. I mean, she seemed a little nervous, but from their conversations, this was her first time ever being on the radio, so that's totally understandable. So for the Axis segment, they had her read the question, of course, because sis um, can't, and participate in the whole Wendy Williams fiasco. Oh, okay. this, oh, this but did you see how she was okay. looking too shorty? Jump right into it. Wait, no. <laughs> the funniest thing was how Drew looked at you when you tried to just go. He was like, uh, I know it was a whole thing. <laughs> oh, you hold saw on. that, shorty? Yeah, you like, what? Uh, uh, hold on, hold on, not thirty two. Hold on, okay. Tread I got ahead light. of myself. Let me tread light. All right, now thirty two. Go ahead. We got a, uh, you know what, female listener right here today. Yes, this is from a female listener. So she says, "I told hubby of four years it was okay for his mom to stay with us until she gets back on her feet. Mm-hmm. She's an angry drunk and tried to strangle me, child." With my extensions or my braids, because I ate the last of the macaroni. Oh, I cooked, okay? <laughs> and he says, if she goes, then he got to go. Help me, please. Ooh. Wow. Ooh. Well, almost. it sounds like you're dealing with um, um, mama and wife or girl drama. Um, I haven't been in that situation yet, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go around it, because I can't tell you how to treat your mom, because I love my mom. Shorty, love you. You love yeah. your mom, don't you like, love your I mom? Love my mom. Thank it's a, you. It's an in-law, though. So this is this is. This I understand. Okay. Don't I don't care. I don't care if you was the president of the United <laughs> States. If my mom <laughs> want that piece of last piece of chicken, she, she gonna get that. She, chicken. she gonna get that chicken. Even with you around, sis. No shade, but I could totally see sis putting friends in the figure for a leg lock over some Leeds fried chicken fresh out the grease. Okay. Okay. Mamas come first. Okay. All right. All right. Um, thank you for cooking the macaroni. Actually, he sent me some. It was so good. I'm just now eating it this morning. <laughs> they sent me some when I when I got here in the station. It was like somebody left you a plate with some macaroni and chicken okay, on there. Okay. And great. Okay. It was good. So my best advice for you, keep it short because I'm a tread light on your mama. Right. Um, I don't think both should go. I think you guys should just work it out. Okay. Um, it's over food. Um, and you can always go back and cook some more. It's saying like you're trying to start some mess uh, with him. Um, talking about is even her or him uh, is either your mom or no, you he go. Said, he said, he said, he said yeah. if you don't like my mama, we he, both are. Well, it sounds like also he doesn't have respect for her because you never supposed to let your mom come between your relationship, but your mom should also know boundaries. Mm-hmm. And, and also your mom does come first. Mm-hmm. But and it seems like to strangle me mm-hmm. with, the with, the no, with the braids. So let's start there oh, first. Help me, help me, help me out. She woke up like uh like uh dude did uh Tyrese on Baby Boy when he mm-hmm. was, <laughs> you choked him. Ooh, you strangled me with my braids and you, we just gonna no. Nah. Uh, uh, yeah. So, so have, have y'all ever been in a relationship where that person's mom didn't care for you or you didn't care for their mom? The mamas love me. The yeah, mamas and the yeah. green. So I've never experienced this. Yeah. But I do feel like for a man, they ha- there has to be some boundaries in a relationship. Yeah. I feel like, yes, invite the mama to the home, treat her with respect. But your man should say, check, you got to check your mama sometimes. Like, hey, ma, you yeah. know, because it's going to come better well, for you than for me. Girl, look her. You can't check the mama. Okay. Well, you can't. You can sit I'm down and be the, like. The son can check his yeah, mom. the son can okay. check his mom. Because if I feel like if I get married, you know, at that point, well, I love my mama. It's coming love, soon. You've been going pretty, wedding after I love, wedding. I love you pretty. Okay. All right. I uh, love you pretty late. But, um, you know, it, it. your wife is supposed to be your number one. I know mm-hmm. your mom is your number one. But once you get married, like, your wife's supposed to take that spot. So it's like, I don't know if I would be on some. I don't know. That's a definite. Shorty, thing. let me just say this from your. You know, I've been around your mom plenty of times, yeah. and 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 you always. One thing I gotta say, you treat your women good. When not you treat your woman good. Let me try. I mean, no, it just came out. Shorty, stop giving me that look. I mean, you treat your woman good, and you don't play about your mom. Okay. So I can't see that. 
you let the woman come in and take a charge well, and not letting your mom say something. Well, she gonna say something, but you know, you really gotta keep, if you want something to work, you gotta keep your mom in the autumn up out of it too. No. Mm -mm. Work, you know? <laughs> my mom gonna be all in it. Ain't no strangling now. Thank I'm you. I'm stuck on the strangling. So my best advice, <laughs> wig, is keep going. <laughs> Cook. You know, that was a fairly simple one, but sis still managed to make it weird. Typical sis. But yeah, 32 Favorites went live in the studio while they were on break. Just kind of giving her perspective on how the morning was oh, going. I'm like, man, like you really doing this. But I feel like when you get nervous, it's when it's a good nervous, that means that you're supposed to be in the room, that you're supposed to be in that place. So if you feeling nervous about something, it got to be a good nervous though, you know? That means you probably called to that room. And as you know, y'all, I this has always been a passion of mine i was going to school for communication but i had to stop because i had to get to the money okay i had already started my business when i was in college and it just made sense for me to stop going and go to petition school so for the the fact that it's being presented in my lap it is i feel like it's god's time you feel me like i'm i feel like this is like the perfect time right now my pages my platform have grown tremendously like i'm really in my bag and i truly feel like this is my season this has been an amazing year and i claim me a vision boy i wrote this down well i didn't write this down but i just asked god to present me with everything that he wanted me to have i don't want nothing that I, I want that i want i want with everything that he want you feel me okay so fast forward to day two and the access Got our girl 32 Flavors in here. How you feeling? I'm feeling blessed and highly favored. And ladies and gentlemen, right now, it is time to X Andrew. Okay. First of all, pause. So let me guess. Um, sis slipped and fell and he landed face first in some KY jelly. I mean, face greased up like it's the first day of school or something. And all for attention. What do you want to bet? Take it away, Drew. Good morning, and it's time for the Andrew Caldwell Show. Okay. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, okay. The intro on the intro. Okay. So you re you guys ready? Let's go. Give me the business. So like you mean that. Say it like you mean that. Ooh, ooh. Shout it out. Ooh, ooh. Shout it out. How you doing? Okay. All right. Yes, Wendell. All right. This story comes from a male <laughs> listener. Okay. I've been in a serious relationship with Tasha for five years. I got a new job at Wendy's and started a relationship with my manager. Wow. All right. I thought she was quiet, but turns out she's slow oh. and now pregnant. She's definitely having our slow baby child. Okay. I don't want to lose my job or Tasha. Help me, please. Absolutely. Hey, Tasha. How hey, are Tasha you? Mookie. Number one, Hello. I want to shout out to um, Wendy's restaurant yesterday. You know, yesterday was National Burgers Day. And I decided to go into the drive-thru and order me a bacon double cheeseburger. No, you didn't. No, you, no, you <laughs> and it didn't. was so good. I, well, if you go, you do, would you like to hear what 32 <laughs> had to say about the news that she found out yesterday? Yeah, what is it? They found 58,000 pounds of ground beef to be contaminated. Oh. So how you feel? How you on feel? Your, on your national... Stomach was bubbling. Yeah. With... Go right now, gotta go right now. <laughs> go right now, gotta go right now. So Tasha... <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, so Tasha, let me just say this. Number one, you are not slow. Um, I've always been called that. So when 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 when, when you when, when we start talking about people being slow, that can kind of hurt because I grew up in a household where I always got called "You're slow," "You're stupid," "You dumb," well, that's and nice. and that's not nice. Yeah. And um, so um, you you're sir, you eat you're you're number one, you're being messy. True. Because you're emailing a person who used to be messy. Used to uh, be. yeah. So you email in the station, you want to be called out on the radio. What I'm going to do is I'm not going to sit up here and dog her out. Okay. Because you the one that didn't use protection. Mm. You the one that laid with her. Talk to mm. And you thought, you thought, remember, you said, I thought, mm -hmm. okay, yes, okay, that she was that way. Uh, my best advice is you need to leave that job and go find you another job. A job is a job, but it seems like that's not going to work out. Or she's going to terminate you so <laughs> <laughs> you know what? 
It should have never been creeping and sneaking and freaking. That's yeah. what I'm trying to figure out. Like, like what we be getting a lot of stories about, like people messing around at work. Like, yeah, when it comes to their manager and stuff like that. I like, can't do that. Conflict of interest yeah, now, like, but people don't see that no more, y'all. Yeah. Now you talking about you scared you gonna have a slow baby? Yeah. Which I'm finna get to that. Okay. Oh yeah. Out of pocket. Oh yeah. That baby can become, that baby can grow and become a millionaire and never look at you in your eye again. Amen. Mm. Keep your mouth off these kids. Whoa. Tasha, yeah. you need to go ahead and run. If you're yeah. listening, Tasha, go Run, ahead. girl. So, my own advice is, do what, do what um, 32 Flight would say. And run. run, Tasha. Then run. And, and I you wrong. I just don't, I, like, my whole thing is like, and this ain't no knock to nobody, you know what I'm saying, who work at somewhere like Wendy's and nothing like that, but it's just like, bruh. You don't think that's you got one woman and now you having a baby with the manager? You, don't, you I don't know, bro. It's but some like people priority. sleep with the manager because they think they're gonna get a raise. Ah, you have okay. sometimes you have to sleep your way up to the top. Oh, I got it. This week he doing floors. Next the week the promotion. Surprise. There you go. Yeah, there it. it is. There it is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, that's my song. Dance, make that dance. Oh, right. dance, make that dance. Okay, oh, dance, this, make hey, this that. Where that oh, yeah. Yeah. here we go. Forty nine flavors. Go like this. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Drew. Good morning, y'all. <laughs> Go ahead, Drew. Go ahead, Drew. You got me beat. All right, anything back to the phone? No, we good, we good. Yeah. I'm going to go. do her uh, entertainment again, but if you are... Oh, I don't need any more. It's a bitch for saying shit. Oh, they said I did a good job. I didn't even see... Okay, did I do a good job? You did. Because, yeah. I, you know, I was not going to go hard or mean. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm alone. Yeah. They watch. <laughs> bam, bam, bam. Go live with who? Somebody want to go live. Go live. I never do that. Drew, your camera screen is so Foggy. blurry. Yes. Yeah, because I got my... um. The gel on it. No, I got my face my stuff on it. No, it's not much right. It's nurse foil and some other stuff. I did. What's up, y'all? Near foil. You don't use the radio since 10 o'clock. Yeah. Girl, I mean, boy, you, you, you tried it. Near foil. You know what near foil. No, no, say hi to boring. Shorty. Are you trying to say me on boring? Please. You know what? <laughs> near foil. Y'all don't use that? Neo sporing. Yeah. Where everybody at? Why all y'all ain't on her this morning? What's up, y'all? He came in asking me what's scrappy my cousin. You know what? Fast looking. Because that's, that's, that's everything about that platform. Why you tell him that? You're not supposed to tell him that. Steven Spill. What's up, y'all? I can't read them. What they say? What's up, y'all? What's up? Oh, and I just Comments and You don't have to put that on your face? What? Neosporin? No. Uh huh. Wait, that's Neosporin? Yeah. Uh, because it, uh, if you also read it, it helps a lot in your skin. That's why your fan, your skin, like, Right now I'm no, shining. No, no, no. And you tomorrow. No, no, no. You mm. is for open cuts. Open Correct. Cuts. It's like open cuts. It's like for scars. For it's like face. cocoa yeah. butter shape. But it is for your skin. My it's dermatology, right. my dermatology um told me to put start uh, dermatologist yeah. told me to start putting it on there at night and sometimes in the morning. Okay. And when I used to do that, sure the whole or not Neutrogena. No, Neutrogena. that breaks me out. Neo Sworn don't yeah. break you out. It don't break me out. That's why you like giving so you just low. Sit Correct. Yeah. I let it sit there. Yeah, and then when I when I'm when it's time for me, to... how the mama be scooping the whole container back. And I'm gonna tell y'all a secret. Go, yeah. And when when you beat your face, mm -hmm. um, beat your face first, okay. and then put a little bit in this for in certain areas. Okay. Bam. 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 Sonny. You taking his advice? Shorty not using. Bye y'all. You taking his advice? Hell no. Okay. <laughs> 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 that's right girl ignore all the foolishness coming out of that big black mouth looks like sis couldn't stand the bonding between the co-host and shorty well sis has no choice but to get over it because the days of him having shorty all to himself are over
So, 32 Flavors went live again today. Trying to give a little rundown, I guess, you know, what happened on the show earlier. And was rudely interrupted by Sis. Thank you. I'm almost finished. I'll be done at 10. Thank you, Uncle. Shout out to my Uncle, y'all. Thank you. Thanks for the push. Great motivation. Thank you. Did y'all tune in this morning? I would love to join. We don't want to hear snooze no more. <laughs> don't play it. I don't no want to hear, no hear it either. Shit. I don't want to hear snooze no more. I don't want to hear all my life no more. That Tusi song. That two right here. Oh my one. goodness. Yes, this. Okay. Yes. I'm like know. tuning it out. That is not me. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to hear that shit no more. Yeah. Neither. What? The scissor? What up, brother? It's just me and Shorty in here, y'all. We on. I don't, what is it called? Not commercial break. But we on like a little break right now. Yeah, we on commercial break. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, brother. Talking about straight up. Yeah. We do need some new songs in rotation. For sure. But don't get that's a whole nother battle. Whole now. nother battle now. <laughs> we only get to control the mic. Shorty got the uh battle. ones and twos back there. Good yeah. morning. You're doing you're going to be a great addition to the team and sh and show. Keep going on. Thank you. Proud of you, Jay. You're doing amazing. Thank y'all. Y'all really gassing me. <laughs> Don't let it be gas. Let it be for real. You you on the radio every morning. Hopefully, I'll be... Um, This is my day two of my live audition for the radio. I'm trying to fill this spot. I already told them the, cheek, the uh, seat cheeks was... Seat. Cheeks in the seat. But tomorrow um, starts another final. So, make sure y'all tune in to uh, Such a Boss Lady. What up, Drew? You can't mute me right quick. I can't mute. You're live. I'm on live. Oh, you are? Mm -hmm. You on Instagram? Mm hmm. You can mute it. How? <laughs> oh, right here? Say, uh, Hold on, y'all. Drew need me to mute something real quick. Hmm. I wonder what that was about. More attention seeking behavior, no doubt. But anyway, we all know Sis is sheltered and has trouble sometimes with you know, pronouncing words and names and just a lot of the English language. But this right here, this was just special. Up in this thing, getting to it on your Tuesday morning. Y'all know what it is, man. Shorty in here showing love. Andrew Caldwell, as he calling himself 49 Flavors now, <laughs> because we have 32 Flavors who has been representing uh, for our home team. Superstar, superstar, superstar. superstar. And tomorrow, my name will officially be... What? Boss man. Such a boss man? Okay, yeah. I'm going got... by each character that comes in this room. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm going by their character, and I'm going by their... Put your their... Little spin on it. Correct. Mm -hmm. Got it. Okay. To make them feel a little bit more special. Okay. Do you feel more special? No. Because we already <laughs> talking about some lemon pepper, honey yeah. squeeze. Hold on. You say no, no. No. 32 is represented. So 32, you also pulled up to the casting call that we had mm -hmm. at Fahrenheit um, for this whole process. And... um. How was that experience like? And like, you know, because I know when you first when you first got on yesterday, you was like you, you was a little bit nervous. Like, how do you deal with nerves or whatever when it comes to that? Because this is like a competition where you have, you know, to your left and to your right, somebody else who wants that same position. How do you kind of deal with that? You know what? It's strictly tunnel vision. Like you have to remind yourself it's all about you. Nobody else. Ain't no competition. You versus you, period. I you like versus that. you, flat out. She said she ain't going against nobody else. She's trying to be better than herself. Yeah. Every day, every day. No, for sure. And she helped me out yesterday because I'm struggling. I'm still trying to recover from this wedding. Um, shout out to Kilo and Stevie, man. I just, you know. He's asleep right now. I feel like I went a little too hard, <laughs> but I was just happy for them. You know what I'm saying? I went too hard. but uh, when It's I was, okay to have fun, Shorty. Oh, for sure. Definitely. Shorty man. had the undershirt off. Hold on. I had, uh, well, you know, I, had put, I, put the, I kept the vest on, though. You know what I'm saying? That's important. So it was still formal because <laughs> I had the vest on. You so, was giving me twit light. Yeah. Giving what? Twit light. What's Twit Light? Twit Light. You know Michael Jackson's song? 
thriller. Thriller. Oh, thriller. You know what? <laughs> what going on? That? What? The... Going you on. know, like what is thriller? Going on. I'm about to mute the mic. <laughs> okay. <What? laughs> du, 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 du. Wait a minute. You out of he had your best what song. Is... I was doing y'all dance. I was you like, what? Twiller. I was thriller. Oh, like, oh, thriller. 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 <laughs> you know what? It. We can't even talk about it right now because I don't know what just happened. So we just go. <laughs> it's it fine. Did you know the song? What you say the song called? Twilight. <laughs> I mean, that is the song. Don't make me know. It's called Thriller. Thriller. Oh, Thriller. Yeah. Yes, boys and girls, you heard that correctly. And um, now, why exactly was this mad about being called slow? Because if this wasn't evidence, then I don't know what is. But more importantly, I think finalist number one, 32 Flavors, did a great job. And she'd probably be a good addition to the show. So what do you guys think? Yes, no, maybe so? Comment down below. Anyway, till next time, knuckleheads.